Hello, this is very random. Today is Wednesday. My roommates and I are having a bonfire in our patio. Come join. up at 8 today actually that's a lie I kept waking up because I have alarms set out throughout the morning I go from 7 a.m. all the way to 8 a.m. I woke up at 8 a.m. at the latest alarm and today is Thursday June 1st 2023 I've just been um, watching like YouTube videos on my phone just to get a little bit of inspiration on what to film today because um, if you haven't noticed I have only filmed one video this week which is totally fine you know I think I needed a little bit of a setback to get back to where I want to be and honestly I don't know where that is <laughs> but it's okay so today I am running a few errands I have work later at 4:30. I always decide to film on days that I have work. I don't know why I do that. This is my errands list. But trust me, sometimes it do be popping off. Sometimes it do be looking like it do be looking like this sometimes. Oh, sometimes the the chores don't end. But they're not necessarily chores. You know what I mean? They're just like things you got to get done. Street cleaning is today, so they're going to do that around 9 and it's 8:45. This is why I wake up early on Thursdays. And I'm trying to get that into a new routine, trying to wake up every day at like 7 a.m. at least. Because the goal is to wake up before sunrise, which is like 5 or 6 a.m. But, you know, we'll get there. Because I do work nights and it kind of like doesn't work out. I low-key smell like smoke. We had a bonfire last night with the girls I live with just because some of them are leaving us. We're all kind of just going our own directions, which is, you know, amazing. I'm proud of all of us for that. We just wanted to hang out, like, all of us together. Even though we all live together, it's kind of like um, we never really see each other just because we all have things going on and stuff. Anyway, we had a bonfire and I smell like smoke and I haven't showered, so the smell is still here, like, lingering. So we're gonna go move the car. Sometimes I say how like I park on the sidewalk and that's exactly what I'm gonna do right now. I'm not gonna lie, I am pretty damn good at this. Oh, I hate this angle. Okay, that's my neighbor. Okay, so yeah, funny story about that. We used to have like a silent feud about um, parking situation. So this is our parking. This whole line right here going all the way to that arrow, if you can see that. They have about three cars. I have one car. They always used to park their cars around here, which, you know, totally fine because they, are, they were here first. I was kind of just like the, I was that one bitch that moved in and was like where's my spot you know what I mean it was like a silent feud I didn't know where to park my car and um, it kind of sucked at first but you know we figured it out I started to park on the sidewalk and it became totally okay um, after a while after almost two years it's gonna be June I moved in August of 2021 almost two years later we get to know each other because they accidentally come to my restaurant but they were like hey we want to plan we want to plan to eat here in May and have this whole party because we can run out this section of ours 
And I was like, oh, yeah, and I also think you're my neighbor. And they were like, oh my god, no way. But yeah, I don't know. You know, get to know your neighbors, get to know people around you. They turn out to be really nice people. And it's, it's, it's a great thing to have more people surrounding you, more people that you know surrounding you. I know most of my neighbors around here, so that is kind of nice. Get to know the people around you, you know? It might surprise you. I have made the crazy decision to um, not go to the gym. Anyway, we're gonna go run errands. I need to go return this skirt I had bought. Not like skirt, shorts that I bought from Ross. They're just a little big. I was like, yeah, these are gonna fit me. No, they're not. So I bought them without trying them on and this is what happens. And now I have to go return it. But you know, that's totally fine. I love going to Ross. Yeah, let's go do stuff. We're back in my car now. Um, we're gonna be on our way to Ross just to return the shorts. So, let's go. Okay, so we made it to the first destination. We are at Ross. Just got back from Ross. I got my money back. I also spent more. We're gonna do a little haul later, but that's all the stuff I got. Am I proud of it? Yeah. I also got this brownie brittle. Pretty damn good, I'm not gonna lie. Anyway, we're gonna be off to Target now. Now I really have to control my spending. Okay, so I just got back home not too long ago. And I do want to show you guys some of the things that I got. So, some of the things that I did buy at Ross. You already know the brown brittle. So, I got this cargo skirt. It looks really cute on. This, like, working out, working out piece. Cute. It's giving yoga mom. And I got one in gray. I got this cute little, like, white, like, flowy skirt. I thought that was hella cute. I'm like, I'm too, this one's gonna be Lastly, I got this Wrangler skirt. Super cute, super rude. Anyway, that's the haul. And from Target, I only got some batteries. I got apple juice, cran pineapple. And, um, I drink a lot of coffee with creamer, so I got creamer. That's the haul, y'all. <laughs>